So anyway, this is what really gets me. Here you got Nikolai Volkov and the Iron Sheik. They're a tag team. Yeah. Now, Nikolai is all about fruits and vegetables and seeds and nuts and this and that, you know, and he gives you a 20-hour lecture on health every time you talk to him. He brings his own pots and pans on the road because he doesn't want to eat in the restaurant, right. goes to the grocery store, cooks in his room, you know, um, and plenty of, gar plenty of garlic, so you always know where he's been. Anyway, Nikolai dies, and Iron Sheik, who's been trying to kill himself for the last 40 years, he's still alive. Now, is it fair? Well, you know, the thing with Nikolai is, what did he weigh? Oh, he was big. Okay, so we know that you can't carry that weight. So he needed to get down to about 230 pounds, no matter what, because your heart can't carry that. Uh, all that bulk, you know how big he was. Gee whiz, you know what I mean? It's just, I, I, I never, I, I, you don't see heavy old people. They just die. That's true. And um, here's a little something that I found out because I know some people that knew him um, toward the end. He lived in Baltimore. Uh -huh. he, he had a heart attack. He went to the hospital and they wanted to give him two stents. Mm -hmm. And he refused and he walked out and died. So please, if you're listening, if they want to give you two stents, take both of them. If you want to live. Yeah. Now, dialysis, I don't know if I'd want to live with dialysis. But stents, you know, it's a little less invasive than dialysis. So everybody's got a choice for the million dollar man. I mean, you know what I mean? It's like yeah. you want to do it or you want to live. You know, anyway, that's your choice. But dialysis, I, I understand that's very major suckage in dialysis. That's what I hear. Mm -hmm. But anyway, Nikolai was a very nice person. Um, Iron Sheik. Uh, you know, I can't say that, but you know, I wish him the best. Hey, I had Sheiky in for a show. I ran my hometown uh, three years in a row in the high school, and we did over a thousand people each show three years in a row, which was good. Just doing basic wrestling, and I had Garvin and Sheik come in. It was the old WWF versus NWA champions, whatever. Blah blah blah. She come in and goes, Rip baby, where's my hotel? I said, Sheik, fuck you and your hotel. I said, You're that's up to you. He says, Oh, I leave. I said, No, you get the fuck out of here. I'll work twice. Nobody will give a shit about your old fucking ass. Go fuck yourself, Sheik. Oh, Rip, you know I was ribbing. <laughs> 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 then he went out, then he went out and got he went out and got color in a match. I said, Sheik, what the hell's the matter with you? Oh, I thought I would spice it up. I said, please don't think. Just put just put Garvin over, please. Oh yeah!